Hey guys, it's JD from Pondsville World, and today we are unboxing and reviewing this $18 gaming uh, microphone made by Tonor. Now, uh, if you guys remember, I reviewed one of their products probably a few weeks ago, and I thought it was pretty good. So uh, I went ahead and got another one of those products, and uh, <laughs> it's a gaming microphone that's $18 that is very cheap for a gaming microphone so uh we're gonna go ahead and see if it's worth it in this video so uh yeah let's go ahead and just take a look around the box uh you can see here g33 desktop usb gaming microphone uh it has a few little things there telling about it and then a nice little picture of what the actual uh microphone looks like on the side nothing much on the back some even more features actually you can't really read that well but you can pause the video and look at that and uh just some specifications and stuff like that there's the label if you want to look at that uh and apparently we got the blue one so there's green blue and red you could select between that and uh yeah so let's go ahead and just look at it so uh let's go ahead and open it up here and uh all right, there it is. It's in a plastic casing. Let's pull that out, and uh, well, there it is. Nothing else in the box. Here is a instruction manual telling how to set it up. That's very nice. And uh, well, here it is. Let's go ahead and take it out of here. There's a little thing that goes on top. I don't know what it's called. Soft, very nice. Set this off to the side, and uh, here it is. Very nice looking so far. Has a USB uh, slot on the back, and then I believe a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and uh, a button. It's basically a volume knob, I believe, too. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and set this all up and uh, see how it's. All right, so let's go ahead and plug this thing in. You can plug it into any USB port. And, all right, there it is. Lights up. And uh, it pulls up as G33 type USB. Just click on that and sure enough, it's working. If you see that little bar that's moving right above my finger, that's uh, when you talk into it, the louder you talk, the higher it goes. So uh, it is working so far. You have input volume on there. And of course, you have input volume on here too, along with the uh, mute button. So click down to mute. So let's go and test that. Okay. Yeah, see, I just muted it and now it's not working. So that's pretty good. Uh, so, what I'm going to go ahead and do now is take a, uh, a little test on this and just see how it, uh, how it sounds. All right. So, I just went ahead and took a recording from the microphone. What I'm going to do is go ahead and turn up the volume probably to about halfway on here and then click play and let you guys listen to it all right testing testing Which i'm gonna bring up a little bit probably more. about mm, six inches away from my uh mouth right now and it's about at probably one fourth volume so let's go ahead and slowly bring it up right now the little triangle is facing forward so it's probably just above halfway volume and you ready for this all the way up that is probably so loud. So that's all the way up on here. Let's go ahead and click the button and I'm gonna talk and see if you hear anything. Couldn't hear anything, so that's good. Hopefully you couldn't hear anything. Let's go ahead and bring the volume down. Let's go ahead and get a little bit closer and see how that sounds. Let's go ahead and get a little bit farther back, see how that sounds. And now I'm gonna stop the recording. All right, so uh, hopefully you can tell it actually sounds really good for a $17 uh, microphone. I'm very impressed by that. Uh, I didn't get any distortion or anything, so I was very surprised about that. Just as long as you don't, you know, get really close, you won't experience audio problems. 
Once again, I was probably about six inches away from the microphone. And if you go that far out, you know, you won't get any distortion ever. So uh, what do I think of it? I think it's pretty good for $18. Uh, I don't think you could get anything better. This thing is really impressing me for the price point. Uh, build quality seems to be just fine. I mean, it's a microphone. You're never going to be touching it or anything. It's just going to be sitting on a desk or whatever. So, um, you know, build quality doesn't matter too much, but it is plastic. This is like a felt or something. I don't know. But um, overall, it, it seems very good. Of course, you can adjust this, bring it all the way up, bring it all the way down. Um, down here, plastic. Of course, it has lights here when you plug it in, your volume knob, press down to mute, and then press uh, to unmute. Got a headphone, oh look, it's actually lit up. That's pretty cool. Got like a headphone jack back here, USB port, and then this uh, somewhat long uh, braided USB cable. So um, yeah, I think this thing is really good. I'm very happy with it. I mean, for $17, I'm really just impressed on what you could get. So um, definitely go pick one of these up if you're looking for a cheap gaming microphone that, uh, you know, sounds pretty dang good. So uh, links will be in the description for this. And uh, I guess that's it for this video. So I hope everybody enjoyed. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.